China's two sessions in 2024 draw to a close. As the two major annual political meetings in China, the two sessions receive wide attention at home and abroad as they summarize the work of the Chinese government in the past year and set the tone for China's domestic and foreign policies for the coming year. In this year's two sessions, a term has sparked hated discussions. New quality productive forces has become a buzzword in China's economy since it was introduced in September 2023. It was written into the 2024 Chinese government work report and listed at the top of major tasks for 2024. With innovation leading, new quality productive forces may advance the productivity freed from traditional economic growth models and productivity development path. They feature high technology, high efficiency, and high quality, and align with the country's new development philosophy. In simple terms, new quality productive forces cover emerging industries such as information technology, new energy, and high-end equipment, as well as future industries such as Meta Universe, Brain Computer Interface, and Humanoid Robots. So how does this term, which is frequently mentioned at the two sessions, be understood by the Chinese people? In their eyes, what impact will new quality productive forces have on future life?然后还有AI这一方面。可能生活会更加便捷高效吧,然后可能也会改变我们的一些传统的生活方式。比如说这个五G社区,就是人进门登自然开,窗户自然走的时候,窗户又关,燃气这些都在五G的控制范围之内。